Okay, well, I hope you're well today. I got my helper, Sarah, here with me. Hey, Sarah. Hey. Uh, we're going to move some bees today from one yard over to uh, a separate yard where most of my bees are. And um, we're also going to combine this little hive with another hive that's been struggling. So hopefully we can boost uh, those numbers real quick and uh, uh, stay on, that, uh, on, the, on the honey that's coming in. So, all right, stay with us. Okay, well, I have removed the uh, feeder here. And all I'm going to start doing is moving these trays over into this tin frame. And then we'll put it in bags as we go. Now the queen could be in any of these. And we're trying not to shake them off. But we'll lose most of the, probably a lot of the foragers anyway. There's a queen excluder below this. So shouldn't be the queen up here. But, uh. Hey, lots of honey. Look at all that nectar in there. That's beautiful. Okay, so they're coming with some prizes. And uh, really, that's what we're going to be doing here for a minute. Just transferring these frames from one side to the next. Taking it out of a 10 frame or an 8 frame. I'm going to be moving them into a 10 frame. And then combining them with another 10 frame hive fit this little net all the way onto this super all the way down i'm going to stand it on its end okay let's zip it up all right here we go that's good right there all right now that gets one box got these in it and we can take them to the truck and stack Okay, well, I'm continuing to get some burr comb and things off that they've been even put on here since the other day. Uh, bees are a little bit aggressive. I don't blame them. But uh, that's okay. We'll deal with it. Sarah's got my smoke rolling. There's a lot of brood. This is just absolute brood that they're... Look at that pack brood. Beautiful. I'm going to stack all this brood toward the middle. On here. And... Uh, I'm going to rearrange it just to touch into this box. We'll keep going. Okay, we got the bees loaded up here. Uh, and ready to head to the house. Okay, well, we are back at our house. Uh, we are right next to the lake. We're going to put combine those other boxes that we have uh, with this uh, smaller hive that has struggled. Uh, they're doing okay because I boosted them so much, but the queen has failed on us, and I'm in the process of replacing her, and this is the way we're hoping to replace her so uh, I'm gonna take top off I'm gonna take this box which doesn't look like it really has anything coming up into it right now this was the honey super I'm gonna pop that off okay and now we will get this box over here unzip it take this queen ex actually what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take first this bump it out queen excluder a lot of bees down in that little box. And I'm going to take this piece of paper. It's just like newspaper, just a little bit of cut the right size here. I'm going to put this over the top of these bees for just a second. I'm going to lay my hive tool on it. And then we'll put those bees right on top of here after punching a few strategic little holes in here and those bees will make their way through and introduce each other a little bit better chew, chew a path and then the next day or so I'll come remove this piece of paper okay well I got this box bottom box uncovered Sarah move these two things out of the way hold that just right there all right perfect I'm just gonna lay this Sink it right up with this other box. You know what? Got it turned the wrong way. Here we go. Pull it that way. Look at that. Perfect. Okay, so we got these two boxes on top of each other. These girls are sitting here humming along. All right, now what we're going to do is add the other box. Okay, got the uh, queen excluder here. This is the first honey super box that, that we've brought. 
And what I'm going to do is quickly go through and just check some of these, make sure the queen is certainly not up here. I didn't see her, but we're going to double check. Okay, we are just checking a few of these frames that we moved over. I don't really have to, but I uh, just want to make sure that I don't see the queen right off up here for any reason. I want to make sure she is down below. I mean, worst case, what it was mean is she'd start laying. This one doesn't have a lot in it. She could start laying in here, but I don't want her laying in a honey super. And we would rather find her. I'd love to mark her if possible. But I don't have to do that today. I don't see any queen on this frame as well. Okay. All right, we're just going to continue to go through and look at frames like that. But right now, these girls aren't extremely loud. Uh, they, they actually sound pretty good. Um, so, feel like we got everything we needed. It feels like it's a good uh, kind of transition between where they were and where they are now. They're going to have to reorient themselves, obviously. They got a lot of room up here to put to put things, honey. Hopefully, so uh, I don't see anything on this one as well. Okay, we're going to keep going through these real quick, but. Uh, Hey, I tell you what, that was pretty awesome, wasn't it? Okay, well, we got these girls relocated. We got them combined with another hive. Uh, Sarah and I made sure there was no queen in that top uh, honey super, and we actually added another honey super on top just to give them a little bit more space. They don't need it right now, but hey, we don't, uh, we don't we want to make sure they know what they've got, especially as a combined hive. Over the next day, I'll take that piece of paper off, uh, but they're going to slowly chew through that and uh, combine. So we want this queen in the top to go down and really take the whole thing over and start laying uh, anywhere she wants to. Okay, well that was fun, babe. Enjoyed hanging out. You too. That was fun. All right, well if you like, subscribe. God bless.